Hey there, let's have a look at how to add Git Bash to Windows Terminal. If you don't have Windows Terminal installed, you can download it from Microsoft Windows Apps website or Microsoft Store. For Git, you can download it from this website, gitforwindows.org. I will leave the links down below. Alright, let's begin. Open up Windows Terminal. Press down Control Coma to open the settings or click the drop down um, arrow here. And now we have to add a new profile. Click new empty profile button. And here let's give it the name git bash. And here is the path to the git executable. And in my case is C program files git bin bash.exe yours may differ of course and make sure to choose this executable file from the bin folder nothing else all right then i want the starting directory to be user profile and now the icon can be found in c program files um, git ming w64 mm, share git git for windows dot ico all right i want the title of the tab to be git bash and i think that's all let's press save now let's test it out click the drop down arrow and then select git bash and i will type hello because i have an alias and now we have a working git bash profile so if we click the plus sign as you can see it opens windows powershell by default i want it to open git bash instead so let's change that as well go back to the settings then go to startup then select git bash as your default profile then press save and then press again open a new tab button and as you can see now we have git bash as our default terminal awesome if you prefer to do all of these steps with uh, just a bunch of code you can go back to settings and click open json file and down here you can find uh, what we have done in uh, json format so you can save this code for future reference and of course make sure to modify the guid with your own all right that was it if you enjoyed this video go check out my windows pro tips playlist for more tutorials have a great day and I hope to see you next time.